and gentlemen, from Wembley Stadium, London, England, the fighters are in the ring, and they are ready. Let's get ready to rumble! Fighting out of the red corner with his trainer, Ivan Kirpa. He's the WBA number one heavyweight challenger in the world, Alexander Blue corner with his trainer, Rob McCracken. Wearing white, the fighting pride of the United Kingdom, the reigning Anthony Joshua. Okay, boys, if I call break, you take one step back. Don't let any punches go on the back of the head. Touch gloves. Good luck, lads. 80,000 plus here at Wembley Stadium, even as he sits atop of the world. Round one, these conditions in a stadium. I have the stadium right now. Boxing world champion. He's dealing with a, a thing, good body shot there by Jock and just missing with the hook. They practice that shot right there, Kenny. That feeling out process in round one as Povetkin. Just because he's very adept at tying these big fight tall men. But Josh has been working on his uppercut as well. They're in the chest, and I don't know whether that's ominous or not, but that caught his attention. Right. Don't take right hands to the body, come on. Yeah. Okay. Come on, good head moves. There, we, there it is. That is a, a three-punch combination. It was a jab, a right uppercut, and a left hook around the guard. It's an uh, it's here for real. Joshua opens up round two with. Listen, you, you stole that round with the last flurry, but I'm in contrast, and there it is again. It was a and there is blood. Right to throw the right punches as a shorter fighter. Did you say? Because he's inside. But he's facing a real test immediately. See sharp that hook again from Pavekin. Pavek knows how to fight taller men with these sharp counters. And then he throws decoy punches to the torso and body. He's setting an overhand punch afterward. But look, Joshua returns a favor there. Josh Good when he is flashing out that long, hard jab. Pavek forward little by little. He's throwing shots where you, where you least expect them. He has it. well, right? You're right. Brian, but he sets them up. He sets up those punches. Like, right? Joshua's literally about letting his hands go because of. Final seconds of round two. Alexander Povetkin with a shot and with his mixed legacy as a pro. Extremely accomplished Olympic gold medalist, only one. Another look as the blood is flowing from Anthony Joshua and a hard right hand lands from Povetkin. Look, obviously, he could be in pain from that shot. Another right hand. Beautiful Povetkin fires it up from Povetkin. I told everyone that would listen. The use of his left hand with his height and reach advantage. How are you scoring it? It could be 1-1, I mean, it could be 2-0. We... Good left hook there by uh, Pavekin. Sway is going to Pavekin, that's what sure could look. No one expected Pavekin a preserved 39 years old. That's the difference. He's fought, he like he picked up lessons. Joshua is also not fighting very touched over and bringing himself back down to Pavekin's level. The fighting spirit as he's coming forward. That's excellent timing. It could be a short right hand. Well-timed overhand right there, which is how he's made hands or left hooks, but he sets them up with power shots. Clean little left hook right there. Come on a title in the WBC. Tyson Fury was the man who first beat Vladimir Klitschko. They will... But that guy is really uh, effective with that left, left eye of provoking. Because around here we get a better look at him. Blood is coming from, I believe, a. It was a clash of heads, I believe. Trainer's never been a fan of white gloves or white. Up close from where we are, but it, it's okay. This is borderline first mistake. And like I said earlier, McCracken, Joshua's trainer, he knows how dangerous a well timed punch can be. You don't have to be as powerful as Joshua to hurt the other opponent being shot for another six, seven rounds. Blood on throws, that's evident. Look, right now I want to see jabs by Joshua. In, in quiet runs, I just want to see flicking jabs. Sneaky uppercut. Overhand right. I have Povetkin. Povetkin in the black trunks. Champion Anthony Joshua. My Klitschko is no shame. Oof. They both went for home runs right there. Miles Joshua. Out. Outlanding with jabs 30 to 2 at least by the stats. Turns it. Look, look at the hook. The hook is Pavetkin coming in. Sergio, good point on the face. You can see just even step coming out of that nose now. So it's 
under control. Your body's keeping that right hand up, which rightfully so because that you cannot look away for a second. Okay, see that back in is. Joshua throwing the jabs there at the end of that round. They swat gloves once again. In the early going, just because he happened to be there and he saw his face red. <laughs> so, uh, for Beckett, he punches, and that's the right punch to throw on a taller, like taller himself, punch, he, he makes himself small, Ray. Perfect small. He's, he, he lowers himself and he explodes up. We're doing that, and that's the reason I saw uh, these, these being protected like that. Good hook there by Joshua. Yes. Now gets some success. Turns it into a left hook in the last second. Very smart. Booked for April 13th in anticipation of another mega fight. And he is being more than tested. Good jab by Pavekin as he follows up with the right hand. Good overhand back. I mean, these are hard shots. Pavekin knows how to punch at the right time. I'm pretty sure you can go this down this. This is how he made a career. This is how he yeah. won a gold medal. Look at that tricky overhand right from Joshua. Just... There you go. See? And a lead hook as well. You're right. The jab to the body. Slayer rejuvenated the entire heavyweight division. There is nothing dreadful about this. Back to its full glory with Anthony Joshua. And tonight, yes, Alexander Povetkin. It's body as well when you're close. Good shorthand slap there by Joshua. What he can get right now because Povetkin is in this fight. Hmm. Well, when I mention this is like a throwback fight, I'm saying we went once again captivate the world and transcend the sport of boxing. You can't take it. I'm going to answer that. Yes, oh, he can. yes, right hand. hand by Joshua. Pavetkin now on his heels. He's hurt. Oh, yes. Joshua yes, steps to his man and big hook in the right hand. Can through the ropes. It's over. He hurt. Joshua trying to get a big right hand. The world. Anthony Joshua, the power behind that. He just has that magic. He has that magic. Fight. Joshua putting his fist up to the crowd here. He stepped toward him. He was not quitting. Not any way he was quitting. And he just got finished off by a big, a great fighter. That is the severe test. And again, you wonder, all right, does harken back to the heavyweights of the 90s when you did have the that, ring. That was a Joe Lewis type right hand. It was a short little right hand. And when they show it again, short little right hook and the rest was just over and perfect. Once, Beautiful. Because once Josh and powerful. Look at how short this right hand was. Joe, a la Joe Lewis, I'm telling you, was I really got the back and the rest was just beautiful. Did everything he could, finished with that. The power is probably just as equally as devastating. It will be a heavyweight class for the gone down a bit, but he was not going away. No, he was still he throwing was meaningful hard. We are going to hear from Anthony Joshua as well. Michael Buffer is the official time of one minute, 59 seconds. Round the fighting blood of the United Kingdom, AJ. And a real dangerous heavyweight tonight. A gold medalist, a once beaten Bebekin. And again, hard shots by both men. I said earlier in the night, but the magazine in that last round. I, I, I'm also in Britain. And get back up. Then the referee looking him in the eye. Take a step toward me. You know, how I'm going. Don't stop this. And he didn't. So Joshua. That's a heavyweight championship right yep. there. That's a unified.